Hi, the purpose of this video is to show how to use your integrated um, joystick and keyboard um, to be able to control a particular PTZ. So what we're going to do here is we're going to set the uh, camera setting on the um, integrated keyboard for a particular PTZ. And it's quite simple to do, do this. The first thing I'm going to do is I'm just going to come along. I'm going to push, push down and hold down the setup button for about three seconds or so. I'd last me for the password and I just hit simply enter 8888 and then I, I push down here on this and it says it's a camera setup that's exactly what we want to be doing and what camera it defaults to 001 unless you have multiple cameras set up you'll always be setting it here but um, because it's the default um, switch setting that you'll have on a PTZ so I'll, I'll I accept that by pressing down on the uh, joystick and I'll press down on the, um, the, the, the actual protocol there is Pelco um, P, but um, you could be Pelco D, you could be the Hick Vision option. There's about four or five integrated into it and you can scroll through the menu here. And I'll just show you how it scroll through. So the baud rate is 2,400. We've got 4,800, 9,000, 19,200, uh, 38,000 and back here to this. So accept, accept this. And we'll see now we've moved on to camera two. So what we've actually done is we have programmed the first one and it's bringing us on to program in the next camera. So that would allow us, we'll say, if we selected camera uh, one to actually control it directly from the PTZ, as long as the settings that we have here are matched what's on the camera itself. Um, so what we'll do is we'll just uh, um, put the escape button to exit out from there. So that, that's pretty straightforward. So in, this, in the uh, series of videos, we have an overview showing the actual keyboard and the different features on it. We have this video which is showing the actual setup to operate a PTZ. And the next video we have is covering the whole area of using the PTZ once it's been set up to um, zoom into different areas, all the rest of it. So it's a pretty comprehensive guide.